Some people have written on some of my monkeypox videos things like, hey, this is a gay person's disease. And it made me realize we have to talk about this. First thing I want to say is that on any of my platforms, it is never a place for homophobia, xenophobia, racism, discrimination, etc. That is just not, um, that's not appropriate here or anywhere. The second thing though is that I deal with facts. So let's talk about the facts here, okay? We know that monkeypox has been elevated to a public health emergency of international concern by the World Health Organization right now. Yes, we do know that it is primarily spreading in communities of men who have sex with men. Those are the communities at highest risk right now and where cases are predominantly. That is a fact. But what also is a fact is that anyone can get monkeypox and this condition, this disease could spread in other communities as well. That is a fact as well. And they must both be duly noted. Remember how monkeypox spreads, right? Through direct contact with the infectious rash or scabs or body fluids, through respiratory secretions, like from kissing, cuddling, things like that. Also from touching items that have touched the infectious rash or body fluids. Even a mother can transmit uh, monkeypox to her unborn child. We also know that right now we have cases of children having monkeypox and very likely there are others who don't fall into the category of men who have sex with men who have monkeypox as well. But once again, yeah, is it primarily in men who have sex with men right now? Yes, but does it have to stay that way? No. So as we look at monkeypox and what is happening, we have to recognize what is happening and what could happen. It's important to know that right now, men who have sex with men and those with multiple sexual partners are at highest risk. That is important to know. But it is also important to know that anyone is potentially at risk as well. These two things can exist simultaneously and they do here as well. What's really important is that we do not perpetuate myth, stereotype, uh, racism, homophobia, discrimination, et cetera, et cetera, and attempt to try to classify this because once again, anyone can get this, though yes, it is primarily in the community of men who have sex with men right now. So remember this, and this is something I think back to when I think back to early days of COVID. I would go on TV and I would actually literally have to tell TV anchors and, and people, hey, this is not just a China disease. Remember people calling it that? Oh, and, and it's not. It never was. We learned that very quickly. HIV AIDS. People said it was a gay person's disease. Uh, well, that's uh, not the case. Anyone can get it. So once again, I cannot predict the future. I cannot say what is going to happen. I cannot say if monkeypox will spread beyond the community of men who have sex with men as we are seeing it in right now. I cannot say that. What I can say though is that it is possible. And while it is possible, we have to understand that while understanding that men who have sex with men right now are at highest risks. Guys, stay updated. I'll keep you updated, but let's just be very honest. Let's be very transparent and um, let's be fair when we talk about these things. I'm Dr. Jen Caudill, practicing family physician, on-air health expert and video creator. If you've not liked and followed my page, please do. For those of you who send stars, thank you so much. Consider joining my subscription groups as well. Also, for those of you on YouTube, please subscribe to my channel. Click the little bell for updates.